Bonjour everyone, my name is Mercy and today finally is the reveal of the makeover of the second bathroom. This bathroom uh, was done um, last year um, with my bathroom. Um, after the renovation, uh, my daughter and I, we cannot decide about the decor of this bathroom. I was waiting for her, but in that time, she was looking for a job and she finally did it. She, she get the job and she is, um, she is not living with us anymore. And I decide, well, that bathroom was a blank slate for me. Um, don't have anything because uh, we have, you know, she have her taste, I have mine, and we never decide. But now uh, it's all mine. <laughs> and then I decide to paint it uh, with a paint that I have already to load the cost of the reno. Uh, the makeover, I'm sorry. And I painted with the color that I did my bathroom and my bedroom. Uh, it's a lovely color. And uh, warm it up a little bit for me. Uh, was uh, like a very iced uh, blue. Uh, I don't get that color. Uh, for me, it was I. I I'm so sorry, I hated it. <laughs> it was more lighter than this color over here. And then, um, yeah. And um, the doors of the shower are glass doors, uh, but by the aesthetic, I don't like it. Uh, I put some curtains um, to, you know, to um don't to see it um because uh mm, i don't like it so much it's the same in my bathroom uh my husband didn't like that he wants to show the the doors but <laughs> it's it's <laughs> okay the the thing is i cover it i i finish cover mine and this other bathroom okay and uh, i'm gonna show you uh i decor with some things that i already have it something i'm sorry this cell phone set that I, i'm full <laughs> always is the same thing i'm full i'm full okay whatever okay the thing i was saying um i don't remember what i was saying but uh the thing is uh, some of the things I'm from stores, regular stores, something I've thrifted, uh, vintage, or maybe antique, um, or maybe not, okay? Uh, but, okay, let's, uh, I'm gonna do it step by step, uh, what I did, and at the end, you're gonna see the reveal, okay? Okay, let's do it. And, um... I'm gonna do a haul, uh, finish the haul that I did, and the last haul that I did in the last video. There are some things that was missing that are already in These the bathroom. These are the walls of the bathroom. There are only three walls, and you can see the color of the paint. For me, it's like a very frost um, blue. Um, it's, I don't know. Uh, the color is not that great for me. That's why I decide to paint it again. This paint is from Sherwin Williams uh, Interior Cashmere Low Luster. Okay, uh, and the color called Feather White is somebody uh, like it and want to, you know, paint with it. It's a sheer color formula and is with extra white. You can see now it's not that much of difference because it's the first coat. 
but when I finish, you're gonna see the difference. Well, we have to wait now for dry and then the second coat. Couple of weeks ago, maybe um, a month from now, I paint the grout of my tiles because of the same problem with the other bathroom. I went to the um, Lowe's and I bought this Miracle Row Pen and super easy, super easy to do and you can see um, after one month of doing it the tiles the grout they are they are super great yeah uh this is the thing that i'm gonna do in the other bathroom okay here i'm cleaning the uh, grout of the floor um because it's not dirty it's just stain from uh that day that he messed it up everything and no matter i clean it up no matter i mop no matter i i uh, use the brush it stay uh you know a little dirty but it's okay but that is gonna change i discovered in one of the grouts is uh, a hole and i put some um some molding clay the same that i use for the frames uh i don't know you re if you saw that video i'm gonna put it over there uh if you're interested to see it okay i'm waiting for um dry and the grouse are completely restored i'm gonna change this doorknobs for these ones let's see well i decide to use these doorknobs uh, they are vintage and i love them more than the other one they are from a haul that i did long time ago i'm gonna put the number of the video if you want to see it if you can see right now the bathroom is almost complete both here in this wall and in this wall is not i'm gonna show you the frames um that i got they're so new they're not okay let's see them and here you have all the things that i have some plates mirrors pictures a little bit of everything and let's see what i um gonna use for that wall well at this time i put the first uh frame as you can see i have to do all this <laughs> okay let's see how it's turned okay finally we are in the bathroom i'll show you first the glass door from the shower okay and uh, it's this very heavy one but yeah i know that's why i have to cover it <laughs> and i cover it with this curtain this atoile de jouy curtain this thrift to find uh have wow like a six years seven years yeah um i did this in this part over here just a lace and some flowers and that's it you can see uh the toile de jouy is very faded but you can see some of the um art over here is you know she is swinging in the tree and it is very old but i don't care i love it and in this part of the wall here is what i did uh it's kind of the same in my bathroom because i have like the same thing uh the three of this 
little shelf with some perfume bottles. Um, some of them have some perfume on it. Some of them uh, are from stores, uh, regular ones, and some of them they are empty. And you can see, you know, uh, what is a true perfume bottle and what is not. And there is the DIY and you only have to put a lid over there. And you make a perfume bottle. Okay. And here is the thing. And uh, here you want to see this is a tree fine. This is from Pop Shelf, $5 each. This is from Dollar Tree to hold the cup from my son for my son. And some three finds again. Michael's some Dollar Tree again. Uh, yeah, some flowers. And here have you remember I changed the doorknobs. The rocks are from IKEA and the basket from Dollar Tree. In the door, I put this um, little, it's like a knob to hand the towel. It's from Amazon. And in this wall, I put a three fine. This is old, and this one. Um, I sh show it already. I hang over here some hangers, a vintage one, and a rope. And here is the this um, towel rack that is supposed not to be in here, supposed to be in here, but the person who did the renovation don't listen to me and he don't want to move it out um, a mess it was a mess but I have to give him a thank you because now I have a gallery wall to distract my eye from the aura that he did <laughs> And you can see all the things, some things I already have them, some things um, from other holes. And the last hole, the missing ones are this little mirror, cost me $2, is from Italy. This one is a heart, is from Italy too, $2, and this one uh, don't have anything in the back have two dollars and this one over here is three dollars is brass but everything that I have I already have it oh my goodness and this one I completely forgot about this one this is a vintage one um, but look at it, I uh, have nacar, gold, and have this over here already. And I have this plate, a metal plate of those um, birds with pink on it. Oh my goodness, I'm in love with this. Um, with this mix of the, of the plaque and the photo frame. This one, I have already have it. I look for a postal uh, art and I put it there. A plate. And this is my gallery wall for this bathroom. And I want to hear your comments. <laughs> This is so, for me, it's beautiful. It's very elegant, very feminine, delicate. Oh my goodness, I love it. I love everything. From the perfume bottles, from the curtain, look at it. Everything from the sink. I don't put anything over here like down, uh, the bathroom downstairs, but it's okay. I 
I hope you like guys I'm in love with this bathroom well guys this is it this is the makeover of this second bathroom and I hope you like it and if so please subscribe comment like and share Abiento, take care and here in this part of the hall I don't know if you can see I put the the little garland or a scroll it's a scroll yeah I put it over here you can see it and right here I put some new plates Do you remember from the hall these three plates and this one over here Here, the only thing that I change, uh, I uh, take out the dome and put it upstairs because it was competing with the bus and I put a plate. Okay, in this part of the hall in the second floor, I put this um, a range of flower that was downstairs in the entrance and put it right here in this wall over here with the uh, picture. Um, frame of the birds and it looks so cute and here in this part over here uh, if you remember I did a mini video about it and right here I put you know the um, the DIY that I did with the hands from Michael's and the dome and the um, cake plate is yeah it's like a you know riser from a uh, Dollar General and here I changed this uh, picture frame that was in here over here to you know to compete with the uh, bus downstairs and that's the only thing that I did and right here I put this in this wall and this is the updates that I have for you